even on the trees, those things can still get knocked down. And <laughs> well, that was a rat, I think. How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flames Plays, and today we are checking out Cruel Nature, an indie horror game available over in Itch.io. I have a link in the description box down below, as well as links to my Discord, Patreon, and Twitter. Go ahead and click on Start, Fade to Black. Let's jump into this game. Sl adjust slider below until text is barely visible. Okay, well, it it's going to look weird to you because every monitor is different. But I do actually prefer the game a bit brighter because my my monitor seems to have some weirdness when it comes to... This is dark as hell. Even, I, uh, I could see start, no problem. Did I screw up? Let me try that again. Nope, the only text that was there was start. But, oh, okay, this is way different now. I, I don't know if maybe the lighting didn't load, or I did increase the brightness a little bit, probably. But, yeah, this is, like, way easier to see. Hey, flashlight. Computer. Cam 1. No signal. Telephone. Ring, 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 ring. Hey, Ranger. Welcome to your new post. Just calling to let you know I've been seeing a hell of a lot of mangled animals out there. Not gonna do anything about it. Just been seeing them. Taking photos for my Instagram. Probably just a bear that's wandered into the area, though I haven't managed to spot it yet. If I had to guess, he's a big, a big effer. Haven't seen animals torn up like this since, well, ever. Anyway, I'd recommend getting out there with some trail cams while it's dark and less active. The new models have a live feed, you'll be able to watch them on your computer. If we can spot it and narrow down where it's made home, then we can deal with it tomorrow. Later, Ranger. Dude, I'm a power ranger. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, we're okay. That's the map. Put that Okay, I need to grab those. Yep, of course. Grab the flashlight. Press F to toggle it. Awesome. Let's put the three trail cams right here by the door. Call it a night. Ooh, an outhouse. This will be good for when I get scared. Generator power. Nice. Uh, yeah, I feel like I might have actually upped the brightness a bit too much. Because I can, I can see forever. I do have to say, too, I love woodland games. Because there's something about... Like, the woods during the daytime absolutely not that creepy they can be creepy but they're not super creepy first one down cameras two the woods at nighttime oh hell no it can be spooky as hell and that's cool i could sprint awesome okay not going across the bridge can i make the jump oh, i can't make the jump all right we'll go back find the trail cam spots Alrighty, we got some weird looking rocks. That uh oh, that's another uh bridge. <gasps> this one I can cross though. Awesome. Oh, whoa, there's a whole oh, there's a whole house here. I'll definitely have to check this out. Oh my god, what there's mannequins. Who cross eyed? What's going on with you? Who is like, yeah, I definitely want to build my house in the woods. And uh, I'm just going to populate it entirely with mannequins, including one in the bed. I don't want to think about what that mannequin's seen. Well, actually, it hasn't seen much. It's missing its head. I don't want to think about what the other mannequins have seen either. What do we got here? A can of beans, of course. Why does this this house looks like, look like it had a second floor up here? Kind of, eh, it's like an attic-y kind of thing. But there's no ladder. All right, is there a basement? There might, there could be a basement. There's no basement. Okay. Yeah, with how rotting that is, I don't think I want to be in the basement anyway. I'd be afraid of the house falling in. Uh, let's see, back to where I was, which was getting lost in the woods. All right, looks like this bridge just takes me to show me that. Doesn't, there's not much else here, it seems. The other bridge would be further down, the one that's broken. Okay, yeah, this is just for that house. So now I have bearings as to where the creepy house with the mannequins is, I guess. But in case I have to return here for reasons, such as not wanting to sleep at night. We got rocks, we got trees, we got crickets in the distance. I do like the sound of crickets have a like a sound app on my phone 
And crickets is definitely one of the noises that I hear because they're very calming. Is it? Nice, peaceful. And that's a dead end. We'll follow the path again. The hell? I could have sworn I just heard footsteps for a second. All right, we're probably still good. Just it's remember, it's just the bear. It's just a bear. Oh, got a little cabin. This is my cat. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm all like, yeah, oh, it's this cute little cabin. Oh, it's mine. I've been here before. All right, so I made the first loop, I guess. There's a lawn chair. Looking. Oh, what's that? Oh, Joe Kim goes here. Wink. Awesome. Right next to... I don't even think this counts as a lake. It's a puddle. Hon Honestly, it just looks like someone had a barrel like this. It just tipped it over. It's fine. It's very grody looking. I don't want to go swimming in it. Don't worry. I've swam in weird water before. That I'm not swimming in that. Oh, here's a campsite too. Anyone here? I see the other one too, but I just want to take a look around, make sure everything's a okay. Doesn't look like it. Definitely seems like they're dead. Oh, oh, oh! Maybe, maybe putting them on the trees is better because camera zero. Okay, maybe putting them on the trees is better because then they can't just get knocked over. In case the bear's smart, it could be Yogi for all we know. He is smarter than the average bear. Oh, oh! I saw something red for a second. What was that? Okay, maybe. Oh. Oh, it was this. Oh, I can take them off too. Neat. That was the red thing I saw. It was literally the thing I just put up there a minute ago. So you can check out the cameras. Now that I have look, put positioned them all. How do I change cameras? Clue collected? What? What clue did I collect? Okay. I don't know what clue I collected, but I don't understand exactly what's going on with that. Alright. Well, I went to the left here. No, I didn't. I went to the right. Yep, I sure did. Ooh, what's this? An abandoned car. Okay. Cool. No available cameras. Right, so I do actually have to take my cameras off the trees and things in order to change. In order to, like, move them around. Which makes sense. That's how physics works. You can't have one item in two spots. All right, cool. I definitely just made a loop and a, a derp turn. So I'm going to head over this way because I'm fairly sure this is about where I put the camera at. Yep, 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 yep. There we go. Got, got it. All right. So now I'm going to go back to where that abandoned car was. Actually, let me check the cameras first and see if I can see camera two. Oh, wait, what? Now it's letting me do it. Camera, camera one? Okay, it's A and D that lets me switch. Camera two and three are off. All right. I don't know why camera two and three would be off. Those were the ones I probably would have, those are, those, yeah, those have to be the ones I put in trees. Because I only put one that was in a spot, or in a on a on a little tripod looking thing. All right, we're gonna put this camera. There's this one here, yeah. Why didn't? Well, yeah, why can't I interact with that one? All right, I'm gonna put that one there. I'm gonna try to find the abandoned car again. Put this camera there, because I I. I I'm, I want to see who's 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 skulking around that car. Hopefully, they're coming back and uh, gonna 
move it away i'm sure i'm sure it runs runs beautifully probably it doesn't have horrible horrible em emissions probably fine Just very well camera is in place my cabin should be over this way yep look at me i'm learning the directions of the game it's a rarity for me to be honest okay the hell is that clue collected okay what is that? Right, so I have car and campground. Where's I? Where did I put the other one at now? Was that the lake? Or puddle? I guess it's probably a more accurate term for what that is. Oh, sheesh. There's like a whole mobile home here, too. Okay. Whoa. New, more cameras on the ground. Uh, oh, it got... Wait, what? How did it get moved? Oh, I must have put it on this tree and it got... Okay. Correction then. It's not about the tree. It's not about the... The hell is that? Okay. It's not about the positioning because even on the trees, those things can still get knocked down. And... <gasps> well, there was a rat, I think. That was just a rat. It was an adorable, friendly rat. And it was definitely not a nightmare. Okay, still good. Let me answer the phone. Da da da. Hello? Prank caller. Okay. All good. I can't. Oh, clue collected. I didn't. I don't understand exactly what clue I collected, but definitely got something. All right. What? That that was a rat, right? Or some kind of furry, fuzzy forest creature that's definitely friendly and isn't going to rip my face open at any point in time. Got a camera on me. Just gotta find a spot to put it. Don't wanna put it in the trailer home. Don't wanna. No, that's going back to the cabin. I wanna try going further out this way. See what it can find. Ooh, actually, uh, could I. Oh, the mannequin. Wait, what? What the hell are you doing here? Was that out? Was that there before? Can I put the, the thing in the mannequin area? I don't... I don't seem to remember there being a green outline area in here, but... Possible it may have changed. No, it hasn't changed. It hasn't changed at all. Can't... Okay, nothing in the ceiling. Get out of here then. Head back. Try to find a new uh, spot to put this at. Fancy high tech cameras. We got, we got fancy GoPros over here. I right, definitely already put one here. Caught that. Oh, yeah, it doesn't even let me do it, I know, because I captured a clue already. Alright, cool. Uh, what about over this away? Got, uh, what is this? Oh, they're beehives, I think. They look kind of like beehives. Awesome. Good to, good, there you go. Good to know they're trying to source local ethic, ethnic honey. With, uh, and also keeping the bee population under control. Not under control, but thriving. Bees, uh, these are very okay. Hearing noises. By all known laws of aviation, bees should not be able to fly. But no, bees are not endangered, but like an at-risk creature. Do 
Did I find anything? No? Nothing at the B situation. Okay. And, like, bees are also really good for the ecosystem in general. I mean, they make delicious honey. But, uh, they also keep a lot of pests at bay. Grab that. I'm gonna put you over here. Head back and see if anything changed. Yeah, I'm not too sure on what's triggering the different clues. But... I, mean, I I would like to. I'll head back here. Don't see anything. Still not seeing anything. That that's the tents, and the abandoned car. Nothing. All right. Um. Let's go back to the abandoned car here. Pull off that camera and see if I can put it somewhere else. I catch something different. I can put it here. We can do that. We can try that. And then we're going to try to find the campers again, which I think they were over this way to the left. Just checking the outskirts here. I'm getting. I'm getting a squirrel stapler vibes. Like I'm expecting to turn around and just see something there. And it's it's really freaking me out. Squirrel stapler squirrel stapler changed like my entire thought process on turning around in games and damn was that good. What's that? It's a backpack. Alright, so is there a stand that I can put this on somewhere nearby? No? All right, cool. Glad, glad to, glad to have tested that out. I guess. All right, got a, a gate there, so definitely not that way. Over here, maybe. Yes, yes. There's a stand here. I could put this on. This is the p weird puddle, I guess. Try that. I believe that means that my cabin should be over this way. Yes. Oh. This, this map feels large, but it doesn't seem it once you know the general positioning of everything. All right, so nothing there, no signal. Oh. That's not a bear, or nor is it a rat. Is that my cabin? Was that, is that? I don't see a red... Oh! Okay. What the hell are you doing? What are you doing? What, what you put Donk Donk over there? What's going on? Where, where are you going? Get back here. Okay, well, I can run into you and you're not a threat. Understandable. Have a great day. We're going to leave you alone. And we're going to just go find that cabin, I guess. Is he still following me? Yep, they are. They are still following me. Alright, well... At least now we know we have a friend with us. Was that the, the mannequin house? Did I die? No, cruel nature. Okay, so that was the... Oh, okay, that was the ending. Okay, gotcha. Understood. No problem. Totally made sense. That was a weird one. I'm going to be honest. I liked the atmosphere and I liked the creepy design of that monster. Not too sure on if that was supposed to happen or not. And the clue detection seemed kind of weird. I don't know if it's like just certain ones would progress it or just all of them in general. A, D, or arrow key. Oh, of course. I don't know why they didn't work the first time I tried. Maybe I didn't put enough cameras down or something. But yeah, Cruel Nature, not bad. I liked it. Let me know what you all thought about it in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate that. And also make sure to subscribe so you get updates for at least new content. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I will talk to you all later. Bye.